Ba ba da be ba da boo. I'm feeling real good. Pokemon, eh? Pokemon, obviously the woman streamer of a lifetime. Women, 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 go! Right? I've already made a video on her. I think she's an absolutely hypocritical waste of garbage space who thinks she's some messiah. Really? Nah, bro. So she announced that she was uh, leaving Twitch. Uh, I think she knows something we all don't like. That service is just going to crash and explode and nuclear bomb <laughs> explode and gone. I think she knows something. She's moved to YouTube, which is obviously a much more secure and safe something that will last for years and years and will never end i don't think well i don't think it will but when this all broke out i actually thought she was going to go to kick which is probably what i think about human beings so she tweeted this the end of an era twitch has been my home for a decade nearly 10 years she's been with twitch and she's left them in the dirt i mean look at that she's the front page when you download the streaming thingy majiggy on the app store so she's clearly a big deal she's obviously very important because she brought out some rip-off cookies and everyone threw up look even twitch has said what an incredible journey it's been we're so proud of everything you've accomplished and what's ahead in the future we'll just have a home on twitch pokey so obviously they're a bit salty because probably one of their biggest streamers one of their biggest earners has jumped ship that shit is sinking we've had the ceo of twitch recently come out and explain that they've not even made a profit yet and that amazon have been very supportive how much longer will they be supportive who knows but like i said when i first saw this i thought they were move fuck it she was fucking off to kick she complained a lot about gambling and stuff like that which i actually agree with i don't think you should promote gambling the same way you don't promote smoking crap on stream same way you don't promote drinking alcohol like regularly you know because it's an addiction it's an addiction and when you see people winning billions even i go you know i want a piece of that i want a slice of that cake even though you're never going to win a billion it's just because it's all rigged isn't it Let, let's be frank now saying that if twitch uh, if kick want to offer me you know 50 mil to come stream on their service then all my opinions and beliefs go out the window i don't give a fuck at that point you know what i mean if i can give my parents one mil they don't get too much right they raised me they've not brought me through fucking world war three i'll give them one mil and then I, you know they can go buy a nice house somewhere or do something what they ever want maybe a nice holiday i feel like i've done a good job as a kid so if they want to offer me 50 big ones yeah boys i'll send you my tsb bank card right here right now let's get into this bad boy and i'll come stream on kick all jokes aside though I, I you know if they said 50 mil but you've got to gamble i'd be like nah bro my addiction my i have a very addictive personality i get addicted to things like a meth head gets addicted to guess what meth that's correct imundo i am honestly hooked on things for a while then i might jump like ship i might have had enough if i got into gambling i don't bet i've never bet on anything the only thing i've ever gambled on is actually horse horse races you know horsey racing thingy majiggy giggy that sort of shit and i've lost you know i didn't win anything i was there you know you dress up in a suit you get pissed as a blother you get blinded you can't see where you're going home you don't even know what taxi to get you don't even know if the buses are working you're like i can know what where are my eyes looking the left right up down in between you know you're staring forward but you're actually looking at your fucking toes it's it's not a good look but yeah so I'm not getting into gambling even I'm a big football fan uh, I would never gamble on it because I think it can be so addictive I have mates young as my age you know I'm 20 they are gambling and just throwing money on each week imagine doing that at you know young age you're going to be doing it for the rest of your life so much money wasted and ah uh, but but we win we win you win fuck all mates I've seen it pre-stream is up first stream on YouTube first of Feb 12 p.m. we've missed it because I don't watch her I don't care but yeah this lady right here she's got a scratch on her chin or something I don't know she's clearly made up her mind and I'm glad for her to be fair I think Twitch is a bit dodgy isn't it a lot of people say she'll be much better off on YouTube we'll find out I think she has a, a massive audience no matter where she goes but I'm glad she didn't go to kick I would have been really annoyed at her if she went to kick because everything she said would just be hypocritical would be thrown out the window it'd be embarrassing if she did that so she's not signed on to YouTube or kick or any streaming site I'm a free as a bird and I'll stream anywhere anytime okay she's she's basically like the streaming hoe she's a streaming hoe of the community she's gonna gonna run around jumping on each each streaming penis you know bounce on that shit see what she enjoys the most and then just keep doing that it sounds like it and i get you know i can't blame her i think obviously critical charlie uh moist meter whatever you call him i really like him by the way he's um gone to stream on youtube he said he, he preferred it so fucking rock on dude i think we'll probably see more people i think twitch is in a very shaky place at the minute and i think the ceo coming out and being really honest i think is great but i don't think it's filling people people with confidence either at the same time i think no one's going wow it's a good thing he's talking I, I feel like i should move to twitch you know people are saying oh my god he's talking i'm gonna move off twitch yeah anyway look pokimane she does what she wants uh she is um still supplying outrageously priced cookies that no one wants and she is still at least she's not a hypocrite though but yeah pre-stream congratulations i guess she's given birth to a youtube streaming career it's cool i don't care though i just wanted to say that i think she knows something seriously 
more than she's letting up. I think she absolutely knows what's going on behind the scenes at Twitch. She's the face. They would have tried getting her on a, some sort of contract to keep her locked in. She's gone, hmm, that doesn't smell right. I don't like this. And she's gone, ah, bro, screw this. I'm jumping. And, you know, respect to her for, for doing it in a, a decent way. I mean, other people have just seen 100 grand, 100 mils and gone, yeah, screw that. And, you know, I can't say I won't be the same, bro. 100 mils a lot of money when it's thrown in front of you just to stream on a different site. Like, who cares? Who really cares? Thank you so much. God bless. Godspeed. Don't forget we've got a Discord in the chat. I mean, a Discord in the description. Uh, we so far have one member. He's my best friend, though, now. So, shout out to you, homie. We'll fist bump later. And we'll play some Forest. Lots of love. I have no idea what that was about. Douche to have a great weekend, lads, ladies, anything and everything. Cool. Bye.